Lalit Modi is in big trouble and he's on the news hour tonight. Mr. Modi, it's not that I always get you on the channel when you are in trouble, but it happens to be an interesting coincidence. Thank you very much for joining me. This is your first television interview uh, since the BCCI uh, now is, seems to be thinking of a life ban on you. You are already in trouble and you're sinking every day into deeper and deeper trouble. I'm glad you retain your smile. Mr. Modi, I have your response. I'd like to tell our viewers that Mr. Modi I'm sent out... With you on, on... Yes. You have your, I have your response, which is your note on the inquiry report. I have read it. I would like to be convinced, but I'm not convinced. And I would like to ask you a series of questions. Now, before we begin, I will give you an opportunity Please to do. reply. But you will have to answer my questions. Uh, you cannot answer your own questions. I will answer all your questions, Arnab. Thank you. But you will allow me to, I, you will allow me to answer the questions, I hope, but... Yes, I will allow yes. you to answer my questions. My first question yes, to you, questions. my first question to you, Mr. Lalit Modi, in your reply about the fairness of this BCCI investigation, you know, you say I was not allowed to depose before the panel. They treated me badly. They didn't give me an opportunity. I wanted to depose before the panel. And I was not allowed to, and hence all of this is extremely unfair. Mr. Jaitley did not allow me to depose, etc., etc. A careful look at the facts, Mr. 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 Lalit Modi, and you are absolutely wrong. I'm not saying you are lying, but you are wrong because you were given ample opportunities. Your lawyers were contacted. It was you who sought extension after extension which was granted, and at one point of time, the BCCI ran out of patience. I can give you the dates on which you sought your extensions repeatedly through your legal counsels, Mr. Hira. Twice the BCCI accepted it. Now, you don't expect, expect to keep buying time, Mr. Lalit Modi, simply because you don't want to answer at a time given to you, but at a time of your convenience. Your time of your convenience may never have come, Mr. J Mr. Mr. Lalit Modi. I have the dates with me, so I would like to know whether you'll take back that charge that you have made on the fairness of the probe. No, I will not, because very simply, the probe started on the 26th of September 2010. Yes. For a period of 20 months, the BCCI put forward their, their witnesses, and we patiently went through them, and we went through each one of them, and, and they kept, whenever they postponed it, we, we, we agreed to it, and we allowed their, their witnesses to come, and over 20 months, they were... Uh, they were, their, their statements were taken, and we patiently went through each one of those hearings. And you also allowed the to cross-examine in my, detail my witnesses to come for a long forward. time. Uh, my def Absolutely, and we did that, and we did that, and no yeah. problem. And all those witness statements are there. I put them up on my side. I, I have no issue with each one of them. I'm not saying that each one, of, each one was right or wrong. But my defense started only on the 3rd of March, 2013. On the 22nd, of April 2013, they abruptly put that to an end. Uh, when, when I asked for time, yes, we needed time because what, what do you mean abruptly? Our, our what do you mean abruptly? Counter question. Allow a counter question. Allow a counter question. That, that take back the word abruptly. Take back the word abruptly yes. because my yes. information is that the disciplinary probe against you was a totally exhaustive process. The BCCI's witnesses underwent extensive, super extensive cross examination by your legal representation. Seven of its witnesses were cross examined for 56 days and for over 153 hours. That's the legal equivalent of Chinese torture, but the BCCI went through it, Mr. Lalit Modi, patiently and well. I think you cannot call it an abrupt process. Would you like they to take that back as well, understand. please? There were, their wit there were their witnesses. No, I won't. All those witnesses, in fact, were in my favor, pretty much. No, but I, and I have no you were given an opportunity. Witnesses. But the point is, they presented their witnesses. It was time for to present mine. I said, that was their witnesses. I, I examined their witnesses. You were given the opportunity. My witnesses to come you were given forward. the opportunity. They didn't want my witnesses to come forward. You were given the opportunity as of my end of March this year. The BCCI said no witness statement of Mr. Modi had been filed till the date, though the last opportunity expired on 25th June 2012. Following a request from your legal counsel, BCCI accepted the request granted time till April 2013 for filing witness statement. On April 15th, 2013, and I have the papers with me. You can challenge me if you want. Right. Your lawyer sought another extension of a week to 
file Modi's sent, witness I, I statement sent the papers on, to, on April 22nd. I, I sent the papers to on, you. Yes, and on, on, no, no, these papers are here. The BCCI has noted it, summarized it. You've not sent those papers to me. On Please, 22nd April I 2013. The papers to you. I, 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 I sent the, pap the papers to you. But these are facts Please in the understand public domain. That the, it took these are facts in the public domain. No, in fact, allow me to complete. Now, and I'll give you full answer after I this. put them in the public domain. Yeah, yeah sure. You did in the public yes. domain. It is in the public domain. Now, don't take authorship of public domain, Mr. Lalit Modi. Answer my questions. On the 22nd yes. of April 2013, your uh, lawyer sent an email the with domain. the subject confidential to the members of the disciplinary committee. It was stated in the mail that the witness statement is filed on confidential basis. A copy is not served to the BCCI. It was further stated, and this is amazing, that Mr. Lalit Modi is undergoing dental treatment and is not available for cross-examination for the whole week. Me. You know, how, how silly is that to well, be dodging? I had a root canal. I had a root canal that day and I said I'll do it after one week, one minute. Hold a root on. canal. Hold on. There's no do dodging out here. I sent the documentation and I asked specifically that I am available on... I, uh, please understand, the dates have to be available to both parties when you're fixing, when you're fixing meetings. They had no problem because there was a court case going on against the complainant, Mr. Arun Jaitley, that particular day. It was coming up next to day. They wanted to show that the meeting had been completed. They wanted to circumvent that. And that matter is still sub judice, which is coming up in next week. And that was the whole issue, is to circumvent that and to show that the meetings are already finished and to go forward and they're going to come out with a report. There was no hurry to come out with a report on that day. They spent 20 months with their witnesses. Another week or two weeks and I'm going to kill them. There was somebody so, will, somebody so liberal in granting opportunities, as they say, to, for, for you to filing witness accounts. You know, this inquiry has to be completed in a certain point of time. Just because you don't want to co uh, cooperate, you're fugitive from the law, you don't it want to cooperate, you want to delay the process, you want the dispensation to change in your favor. I didn't want to cooperate. If I didn't... One second, Arnab, Arnab, if I didn't want to cooperate, I would not be sitting out here. If I didn't want to cooperate, I would not be sending documents to enforcement or to the IT or to the other departments you, or, or, or being problem. proactive and going out and then doing problem. it. So let's not get into your the issue about me no. not being, no, no. being proactive. No. Your problem My, is that you call yes. this a witch hunt. Go ahead. You call this a witch hunt. Now, come on, Mr. Modi, where's the witch hunt? The main protagonist of this is hiding in London, is speaking to me tonight from let's London. Go each, let, let's go through. Let's go through. Let's go. Let's go through each of. The, let's go. Let's go through each of the issues that they want to, want to penalize me on. Let's sure, go we'll go them. through the let's issues, go but one. we'll we'll go through the issues. But first, answer to me: this business of being a witch hunt. This first show cause sent you in April 2010. Two more follow. Three alleged acts of indiscipline and misconduct. The entire procedure concluded with the findings of the disciplinary probate published yesterday has taken three years. It's taken three years. The BCCI has gone into detail My on each sir, of the charges against you. First and you. foremost. Each of the second. charges against you, they one weighed second. their evidence and arrived at a judgment. Please understand. The first one minute. Anna, 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 please, one second. Please, let's be, let's be very clear. The complainant in my case is the chairman of the committee. Okay, Mr. Arun Jetli. He himself is the complainant in the first place, and he sits and chairs and on a committee that 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 is going to crucify me or or, or do a disciplinary committee uh, hearing on me. Um, when the time comes, they put all their witnesses through for 20, 20 months period. We patiently go through them. Most of the witnesses are in my favor. Each one of them pretty much are in my favor. In, in fact, and uh, in, in, in what they say, in the people what they say, they write to bury them. I have therefore made sure that all these witnesses statements are available on my website some are against me some are for me so what's your what, you, what that. is your what when is the time came for me my witness statements to be put up no what is your what is your what complaint is what? what is your complaint i'm not understanding you went to the court you they dismissed my complaint is, you, you, my, you, complaint is my complaint is my complaint is my complaint is they didn't give me time to put my witnesses forward and they didn't give me time for me to come forward myself. I then therefore but made a written submission for all their complaint. I made a written submission for all their, for all, 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 all that they have accused me about. And they said we will not take that on record also. And, so and, and that also, that a full submission of all the charges with all the documents, I have also made that available on the site. Why shouldn't they take that into account? No, what are Even you, if I didn't make are you, it, are you, human, I didn't make are it. You want to be your own court of appeal? I, at least. You want to be your own court of appeal? You went to the courts. You went to no, the I courts. Fear, you challenged your suspension as commissioner. The court of appeal. The court of appeals. 
Yes. You challenged your suspension and as commissioner. You approached the courts for the reconstitution the of the disciplinary committee, including Mr. Arun Jaitley, with whom you have an axe to grind, probing the charges against you. Your attempts to approach the courts failed. But Bombay High Court grind, rejected your petition, so second, did the Supreme Court. One second. But he did not... One second, because he forgot to disclose at that point in time, and we did not have the document at that point in time, that he himself was the complainant. Only that document was made available to us late last year, we found, got from somebody. And that's how we came to know that he was the original complainant. Now, complainant himself uh, wants to chair, just like Mr. Srinivas, and you're going on the other side. He is somebody has a complaint against him. You're going to, he's forming his own committee and having his own people. This is even worse. But Mr. The Jaitley, you can't, you, you can't claim bias unless the court says so. You, you, can't, you, can't, you, you can't claim bias because the court says so. Everybody is biased against that Lalit Modi is your argument, you see. I, that your is basic why, argument that is, is everybody why, is biased against me. That is why you, I have gone to court. I, that is why I have... That is why... That is why the matter is sub still yeah, so, in Patiala court. So, so if the Patiala court says that Mr. Jaitley... Has is the right. The matter is subjudice. Has the Patiala court said that? That's why I'm saying the matter is coming up Has the court said? Has the court said that Mr. Jaitley or anyone is biased? You can't claim bias unless until a court says so, Mr. Lalit Modi. I didn't say be aware that. Of the fact I'm not saying that. Of I'm the saying, process. I am saying that is my plea. I, one minute. One minute. I am saying that is my plea. That matter is subjudice. As and when it is now decided, we will take the law at that let's point. Let's look in at time. the allegations we go now. Ahead with the, uh, uh, other issues on on the table. Let's look at the allegations on which you've been found right. guilty, Lalit Modi. You've been found guilty of bid rigging. Oh, that's terrible. You're rigging why the not, bids. Why only guilty? You, let's see uh, each one of them. You know, no, I'll, t I'll take a poll. I'll, I'll, I'll take a poll. I'll take a one by one. I'd like Which to start bid? with bid rigging. Now, that's a terrible charge, you know, and there, and there is substantial amount of fact there okay, that is like there against you. To be rigging okay, bids. Let's look at. Lalit, let's look, to, you let's, not, let's, no, let's first look, of all, allow let's me. Let's look at the facts. Yeah, I put the facts. The, the, fact, the, fact the facts. The fact is that you, that you, that, you know, you rigged the bids and based on the minutes of meetings, the BCCI said that the president, as evident from the meetings, was not aware that such onerous and unreasonable conditions were incorporated. It adds that you had merely informed the president but did not read the clauses. You brought in clauses to favor certain groups, to go against certain groups. You were out there, you know, basically acting as an advocate on behalf of certain interested parties. I mean, come on, Mr. Lalit Modi. You may have been the person who created IPL and you may One have minute. done a lot of good. That let's, does not give you the right. Okay. Does not give you the right. You have, you to, have, to, you have to, 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 oh, to carry Mr. out bid rigging. Mr. Arnab Goswami, you have said what you have to say. You have, you have put the charges and you have said what you have to say. Yes. Let me respond to the charges by saying bid rigging. Let's be very clear. What are the two clauses I inserted and which the president and everybody knew? I said that the bidders must have a net worth of $1 billion, number one. Number two, I said that the amount that they're, they're bidding must be bank guaranteed or they are going to default. And that is the clauses I put, not for myself, to safeguard the BCCI interest. Let's go back to 2013. We are sitting here today. The Kochi franchise has defaulted and has resulted in a $300 million loss to the BCCI. The Sahara franchise is terminated, and there's a loss after paying for two years. There's a loss of over $300 million to the BCCI. That's a $600 million cash loss of agreement signed, bid signed by me, which had clauses that required 100% guarantee to safeguard Wrong. the BCCI. Wrong, Mr. Modi. 